made a big mistake today, and if you see the film that I made yesterday, where I play the piano, you'll see the difference in the mistake. And the mistake is just that I cut my hair off. And uh, that's because, because I tried to cut my hair with this, with these peck clippers, you know, well, they're not peck clippers, they're for cutting, home hair cutting, you know. But every time I do it these days, I don't know. My hands are not as steady as they used to be. And I uh, don't get an even result, so I get disgusted. Maybe that's the provisional talking to me. And I end up with no hair. <laughs> I know it'll grow back, I don't really care. Uh, I always had a trouble with wavy hair. So, for today we wear the hat. Um, yeah, I'm still reading, no, I'm, I'm on the last, like, ten pages of The Essential Jung, and uh, that's been my big study, so I thought I'd talk about Jung for a few minutes. We're on self-knowledge in the last chapter called The Undiscovered Self, and, um, well, he doesn't have a lot of hope for the human race, especially in the Western world, and he's writing, responding to the Iron Curtain, um, He's responding to the Hungarian-Polish uprisings, uh, and he's he's responding to capitalism sort of running amok, um, and how it, it, it clouds the process of what he calls individuation. There's some sort of belief, core belief system, uh, what he would call an archetype, or arche in Greek means the beginning. Um, so the beginning, the original type that is inherent in human beings, that we have certain things about us that are archetypal. And um, those things really, I mean, they must make an enormous list. They change from, uh, well, they, they could change at uh, whim, really. Uh, you can draw up your own list of things that you think are archetypal, you and somebody else. That's what's going on with all the hair. And I thought I'd just make an old-fashioned film to see how it came out in comparison to the high-definition ones that I've been making, uh, mostly of uh, old footage, but, uh, well, they're not really high-definition, but I do have a, a lot of high-definition film. They take so much longer to do, it's rather a pain in the neck, and I'm wondering how much longer I want to bother with, with this sort of thing. So, we leave it there.